Okay, um, right, so I'm here with uh, Beth Rag, who's a sports lecturer uh, who uh, used to study at uh, CCSC. Okay, Beth, um, to start us off, when was it you were here at uh, CCSC? I think it was two until 2011. Right, okay, so uh, you'll, you'll probably remember quite a lot of this stuff, and I'm sure they'll, uh, they'll re remember you. Yeah. And I said that you, so your, your role is a uh, sports lecturer. Um, so can you just give us a bit of detail about where you work um, and what the, that kind of role entails? Yeah, um, so I work at the City of Wolverhampton College. Um, I only started back in September, so I'm quite a new teacher. Um, my role is mainly, well, lecturing, so I teach um, individuals between the age of 16 and 19. Um, and then some older learners as well, sometimes in the fitness courses that we deliver. Um, so my, my job basically entails planning, teaching, marking. That's my life at the minute. <laughs> I understand that. <laughs> right. Okay. And, and what, from a kind of personal sporting background, were, were there any kind of sports that you favoured, that you were really good at, or were you just good at everyone? Um, well, I, I like all sport, but um, I trampolined when I was at um, CCSA. Yeah. Um, and then when I went to college, I took up volleyball and I competed when I was at university. So that's been my main sport since then. Oh, right. OK. Um, so you've not been doing the, the job for a long time, but what's, what's, what have you found is the favourite part of your job? I think my favourite part is my tutor group, um, because when you're teaching, you kind of get wrapped up in the actual teaching and the assessment side of it. But with your tutor group, you really get to know them and you can help them with any personal problems or applying for university, which I've really enjoyed doing this semester. Right, so it's, 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 I suppose it's a bit like a form tutor role. I mean, how, how many people do you have in your tutor group? And there's 11 of them, so it's quite a small group, so I've really got to know them. Yeah. Uh, but they're a football group, so I've been trying my best to learn football over the past few months. <laughs> it's not my best sport. Right, okay. so they're teaching you and then you're, and you're teaching them in, uh, in, yeah. in turn. So what would you say is the most challenging part of the job? I'm, I'm expecting to say marking at this stage, but what, what would you say is the most challenging thing? Um, marking but mainly because it's a time balance of it all so I've got to plan I've got to um, sort my lessons because it's my first year nothing's planned from the previous year um, and then balance my marking getting that done in time to be um, verified by someone else yeah. so that's probably the toughest part of it is balancing everything I need to do right okay and could you just kind of explain the path from I suppose being at CCSC to where you are now so what kind of uh, either different jobs you've done or what um, qualifications you've worked towards to get to to where you are now as a lecturer? Yeah, um, so obviously I studied at CCSE. Um, I, special, my, I think my GCSEs were a drama, PE and geography. Mm -hmm. So I then went on to college to study A-levels. Um, I did a year of A-levels. Um, I think I did biology, PE, psychology and sociology um, and really struggled, didn't really like the format of it. Um, so I went on to BTEC, um, did BTEC sport for three years, um, finished with the highest grade I could get. Um, went, got, went to, applied to university in Birmingham, went to university there, studied sport, PE and coaching science. Mm -hmm. It's quite a long process by this point. <laughs> um, at this point, I was sick of education and um, I wanted a break. Um, I couldn't really face doing my PGC and more coursework. So then I had um, a bit of a year, I had a year break, mm -hmm. um, worked at Staffordshire County Council. Um, just, just doing admin and mm -hmm. um, earning some money so we could um, save towards our house yeah um, and then once well it was about a month for doing that job and I realized that teaching is what I want to do admin is not what I want to do <laughs> fair enough yeah and then I did my PGC last year um, loved it and then I got my job all right brilliant excellent yeah. so it sounds like it, it sounds like it was a long process but one that was obviously dead really 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 worthwhile I mean one, one last question for you if you weren't doing this, what what would be your dream job or your ideal job? Or if you, so, if you weren't a sports lecturer, ah, oh, it's really random what I'd like to do. All right, um, it's probably floristry. Really? <laughs> that sounds so random, doesn't it? Is that, um, is that something you do already, like a, as a as a hobby, or is it just something really creative that you'd like to do? Yeah, I do it a little bit as a hobby, like drying flowers. Um, but it's mainly because when I studied at Newcastle, they had a floristry bit in the entrance part of the college. Right. And I used to always walk past and think it looks so relaxing. I'd love to do that. Right. So then uh, so after being a sports lecturer, you, you're then going to go on to be a, a world renowned florist then. Excellent. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. That's brilliant. Well, thanks ever so much for your time, Beth. Much, uh, much appreciated. That's all right. Take care. Thanks. Bye.